Welcome to Synthetic Oil Protection. I'm your host, Eben, your oil and lube specialist. Today, we're changing this thing. Yeah, the oil filter that filters at 99% efficiency at 20 microns. All right, I just gotta twist that sucker off like butter. And we're back after about 3,500 miles. And here we go. You can do this on any car. You can change your filter. And we're doing it because we got all this signature series oil that cleanse the oil, cleanse the motor, and it got the old carbon buildup out. And now, got it right here. And now you can take a look. So that's the old oil, it's super dark. And even though it was only in for about 3,500 miles, basically the heat and the oil actually got all the old oil buildup out of this motor. And this motor is extremely hot, it's driven in Las Vegas. And uh, we did an engine flush, which got a, about half of the old carbon buildup out, but the other half actually comes out over time. It's like scrubbing a frying pan. If you scrub it for 30 seconds, you're not gonna get all the stuff off. You gotta scrub it for a long time and let the chemicals do their work. And as you can see, you've seen what the chemicals have done. They've gotten a lot more buildup out. And inside this filter is about a few ounces of paste, all that carbon is in there. Filter is good for 15,000 miles of city driving. And now we just top it off a little bit. It's on an angle, so we're gonna fill it about three quarters. Just like that, a little bubble bubble. Lube up our O-ring. And now it's time to go ahead and rotate her. Stick a finger in and just twist it. And that gets it, it's better to put a pinky in because it spins better and that goes all into the media and it's saturating in and it actually sucks it up like a sponge, those actual synthetic media that holds four times more contaminants than a cellulose paper filter. And now you can see, even if we go almost sideways, it barely comes out. See, there's all that media sucking it up like a sponge. All right, we're gonna thread on our filter. <laughs> spot but we got her and now we just firm her down until it goes three quarters once it touches so it touches right oh, right right about there and now three quarters and and now we just spray her with a little parts cleaner what we call our Niagara Falls in a can. All right. Right there. What? Time to go ahead and check our dipstick so we didn't add any oil yet. Always careful with your dipstick. You don't want to bend it. Always be easy. You can break it off. The plastic piece in here can break. We're all the way in. We're going to pull out and we'll see where she's at. Hold her level. And she's about almost in the middle. She's right about there. She's looking good. We're just gonna add our 0.22 quart. And now we know she's just the right level. So now we're gonna add our 0.22 quart. And I can just do it by feel. And that's it, perfect. And now it's time for our PI Performance Improver. This is a proprietary gasoline additive that cleans your valves, injectors carbon deposits inside the combustion chamber. And now all you do is just shove it in. You put that in every 4,000 miles, which we're back after 3,500, which uh, is a good time on your first oil change to do it a little earlier. That way you get that old buildup out. And now we'll go drive her. We changed the oil on her car back in June, and now she's good for another 11,000 miles or nine months, whichever comes first in this oil. It's good for 15,000 miles of severe service driving here in Las Vegas. This is the owner and the, the first person Hello. to change it over to the liquid gold. And it's been how long now have you had it in? Uh, two months. All right. Maybe. And how's your vehicle been running? Great. Wonderful. Awesome. awesome. Super smooth. I'm excited now that the filter's changed again, that it'll be even smoother. All right, we'll see. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Wee. Just watch for 
police, there could be there could be chips around. I don't want you to get a ticket. Just keep it easy. It's thirty-five. <laughs> Going on a road trip to Colorado. Nice. nice. So I'm excited. Sweet. We'll be, she's been on lots of road trips. This will be the first one since switching over to the synthetic wow. oil. Wow. Nice. Yeah, nice. I'm excited. Nice. turn around wherever you feel comfortable. Whatever it does it feel really smooth. Like, is there supposed to be that much of a difference just from changing the oil filter right now? Yeah, because once the filter gets full, it goes through the bypass valve. You hear a lot of people talk about the bypass. And basically, once that filter media gets full, it'll never clog it because there's a special bypass that lets it bypass the filter media. And that's why that oil is so dark is because it's just floating in suspension, which you really don't want all those particles in there because that carbon is stronger than steel and that wears out your motor. So by us changing the filter, not only is it running smoother because it's going through the filter again, it's also gonna have less wear particles that can uh, cause uh, you know <laughs> premature wear to the rings. You'll have better compression and uh, everything else. And now the fuel, second round of fuel additive is cleaning the valves. And so what percent smoother would you say it is right now? Um, and if we have the AC off, you can turn it yeah, off if you yeah. wanna feel it with the AC on. I mean, I can also wait till the light turns green again. All but right, I'd say all right, like, all right. we'll, we'll, we'll at do it least, here. okay. All right, let's see. When the light turns green, we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> I have an idea, but. Cool. <laughs> so you do the road trip every year to Colorado? No, this will be my first time actually. Nice. Yeah. That's awesome. Oh, it's so hot. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. What is it, 109? <laughs> yeah. 109. Yeah, I'm trying to get out of the heat. Yeah, I've been to Colorado once, but this will be my first time driving there. Sweet. Super sweet. I don't know if I'm over exaggerating, but I feel like it's it's at least 30 percent. All right, smoother. and that's with the filter and the fuel additive. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 If you want to try the products, you can order them right here at SyntheticOilProtection.net. And when you use my website, I'll be able to answer all your questions. Uh, have fun. All right. <laughs> all right. Have fun. And uh, other than the filter being tricky, how hard was it to change your oil? Other than this, this car was a little tricky with the filter, but yeah, it was easy. Yeah. I think for me, it was the first time I had ever done it. So having you there to like direct me Sweet. was very supportive. Um, but other than that, it was pretty easy. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. All right. So there it is. If you want to yeah. see the first video of her changing it, yeah. check out check this it video. Out. It's funny. <laughs> it's really funny. We was having <laughs> loads of fun. That's what counts. And we say on the channel, if you keep your vehicles wet, lubed, and protected, your vehicles will always be happy. And uh, when it comes to being wet, that's the water wetter, the Dominator coolant boost you can put into your coolant. Lubed, the gear lube, the motor oil, power steering fluid, transmission fluid, that's the lube and protected, the silicone spray, the metal protector, your locks, your mechanisms, keeping all your rubbers moist and malleable. That's what makes the difference. I keep it moist. Oh yeah. Keep it moist, keep it juicy. And that's why, yep, one of the original <laughs> sayings on the channel, the wetter, the better. And as you take care of your vehicle, you'll realize just how true that is. So check out this video here in the middle. <laughs> we'll see you back next time right Bye. here on Synthetic oil protection. Cheers to protection, protection, protection.